can't believe how happy this stuff makes me. Hi you guys, welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. I have my FabFitFun Spring 2019 edit sale items and they are in here. This is the smallest box I've ever gotten. They have their cute little logo on the side and I spent $133 and then with tax and everything it came up to $145. I have my computer here so I can double check these things as I'm filming this video. So uh, that's the best I've ever done. That is... By far the least I've ever spent, by far? I don't know about by far, but it's the least I've ever spent, so that's really awesome. I've been a member since uh, fall of 2018, so this is my third quarter going through this. And, oh, I have a mystery bundle. I ordered a mystery bundle. I'm gonna save that for last. I am really kind of nervous about it. Okay, so here's everything, oh my gosh. Oh, I can't believe what this does to me. Well, first thing first, I got the Namaste Skin Turmeric Daily Facial Cleanser. This was a last call item. It was $5, and I was looking for a facial cleanser, and I couldn't really decide on one. I was leaning toward the Juice Beauty one, but there were so many negative reviews about it. I just didn't want to count on it being okay, so I went for this one. A lot of people said that this was awesome, and then uh, in the spirit of that, I also got their moisturizer because a lot of people said that their moisturizer was really good as well. This was also $5, also in the last call. As far as I could tell, this is cruelty free. The moisturizer has really good ingredients. So far, from what I've learned, I don't see anything alarming in the ingredients list on the moisturizer. And then in the face wash, I did hesitate to get it because it does have pegs and I've been trying to avoid pegs. I will link a brief article to pegs in my description box below. To, it will explain why pegs are toxic to our systems. So I got these. So that was $10. These were $5 each. And then this was the hot ticket item for this sale. This is the Tula Press Serum. People were just gunning for it. This was $14 in the sale. It looks like this. Very cute packaging. It feel it's got weight to it too. It's got it's sealed, so I will do I always do reviews. If you're new to my channel, I, I always do reviews on the products that I purchased from FabFitFun. So this is a uh, mineral sunscreen by Barra Public, which I believe is by Kula. That's what the front looks like. Yeah, by Kula. Mineral sunscreen, this it has the titanium dioxide and zinc oxide. If you hear about sunscreens having harmful chemicals, the ones that you want to look for that do not are mineral scent sunscreens that have titanium dioxide and zinc oxide. Those are reef safe and they are not harmful to our systems. I am going to go ahead and see how this rubs on my hand for you because mineral sunscreens do come out opaque. So this one, I have seen some reviews and some people say that they can use this under their makeup and they really, really like it. Well, that was more than I wanted to squirt out, but... Okay, so you know what, this is, you can't see this. This is amazing. It has an interesting powdery texture. This is amazing. I'm so excited. This, I am so excited. Look at that, you can't see it. It, it, yay, yay. So far I recommend this. I saw some YouTubers who recommended it as well, so I decided to get it. It smells good too. Just has like a nice uh, tropical kind of smell. It does not smell like sunscreen. I just like the sunscreen smell. Okay, the next thing that I got is the Snow Fox Skin Care Cucumber Recovery Serum. And this one was a really, people were really, really curious about this one on the sale too because it is new and the person who came up with it has very, very sensitive skin. She suffers from rosacea. She wanted to come out with a skincare line that was really friendly, particularly for rosacea. So if you have sensitive skin, this is definitely something that you might want to explore. I, I bet you that it will show up in a sale in the future. Forgive this, I went to the dermatologist and I have what they said probably is squamous cell carcinoma. They're gonna biopsy, or they did biopsy it and I'll get the results. If you have any experience with squamous cell carcinoma, let me know in the comments below. It's a clear, It's you might not even be able to see it. It's clear, it looks like aloe. 
I can only, I don't think it smells like uh, anything. I can still only smell the sunscreen. And then I grabbed this. This is the Brio Gio Rizarco Milk Leave-In Conditioning Spray. I have seen this so many times. So many people rave about it, and I had to try it. I don't think that the leave-in conditioning sprays are actually the best for my hair type. My hair is up right now, but if you see any of my other videos, I usually have it down, and it's very, very coarse and curly. But I just didn't want to be left out, so I bought it. And I'm sure that I will like it, though. I usually just need to top these off with some other product that is more geared toward curly hair. And then I got the Kopari Coconut Oil Lip Glossy. This was in and out of my cart because I did see some people say that they didn't really like it, but for the most part, it had really, really good reviews. I've been using the Jouer that I got in the winter edit sale and I love it but you know that'll that won't last forever so I wanted to have something that would be there for me when that run out ran out it comes out really fast I have a lot to work with on my lip and it's a little runnier than I expected but that's fine I think I remember somebody saying it's really runny but it's not terror it's not too runny you definitely will be want to be more controlled when you apply it I like it it smells like candy it makes me want to eat candy I like it. I think it feels good. Yay, I like that. And I'm so excited. I am going to do one of these creepy posh peel, feet peel, foot peel things. So we'll see how this goes. I will film it. I'm going to make a video. I'm going to try it out. You'll see. You'll you'll be right along there with me. And then, oh, I got this other thing by Tula. It's the Dual Skin Reviving Treatment Pads. This was five bucks and it comes with seven. No, it was seven bucks and it comes with five pads. I am assuming it's one time use, but people were saying that this is really excellent too in the reviews. I didn't want to feel left out and I figured I, I would grab one too. And then I'm really excited about these two things. Oh, and then I still have my mystery bundle. Okay, so the next thing is the glitter flip lips, lip stuff. And I want to thank Natalie McDonald, she's a YouTuber. Well, I don't know if she's actually a YouTuber. She's a subscriber friend, and she encouraged me to keep it in my cart. I had decided at a point that I wasn't going to get these because my husband doesn't like glitter, but then she said, we must practice radical acceptance, and then I said, okay. So I put them back in my cart, and I'm really happy that I did, so thank you, Natalie. I am going to do a little swatch for you and actually put one of them on, but I will swatch them both. So this is what the box looks like. I'm just so excited. That's the box. It's Siate. These were all over Instagram. I had never heard of them. I'm new to all this social media stuff, but they were all over Instagram at one point. Maybe still, I don't know, but. And so that's what that looks like. Super cute, super pretty colors. I was able to see them swatched on YouTube. And this color is called Crush. There's the applicator, doe foot. Applies really smoothly. Let's see how it looks on. The idea behind these is that when you push your lips together, glitter comes out, so. Oh, I don't know, I don't know if it's showing up on the camera, but it's showing up and it's so pretty, it's so subtle. Oh, I'm like a princess. It's so subtle and pretty. Look at this color. Thank you, Natalie, thank you. Thank you for encouraging me to keep these in my cart. So let's see what the other one looks like. So this is it. It looks just like the other packaging except for it's more of an orange tone color which I'm really excited about. And this color is called Chaos. Okay, so that applied really evenly as well. It's a rust tone. I don't own any rust tone lipsticks. I can't believe how happy this stuff makes me. Okay, and then the last thing, uh, other than the mystery bundle, is I got one of the dewy sticks from Ciate. They're an Italian company. They're cruelty-free. I, I just, I've been wanting to play with, like, glow stuff, because I always see, like, Tati, oh, excuse the bra, I always see Tati's shoulders, and they just look so glowy and pretty. I got the one that was more gold. The other one looked really pink, so I am going to swatch this. I'll just put it here. See if you can see. Look at that. 
Oh, that's so pretty. Oh, look at that. <gasps> that's so pretty. I'm gonna be doing a full face of makeup video pretty soon. I actually just bought the stuff I'm gonna use at Ulta earlier today and you should you will see that video coming up. I have never done a full face of makeup on myself. It'll be a really interesting and probably hilarious video. I hope to see you there. That's everything aside from the mystery bundle. Now, I already like it. There's something in here that hasn't been an available in a sale, but I had purchased it and I had used it and I really liked it. And it is the Grown Alchemist Age Repair Phytopeptide, Age Repair Moisturizer Phytopeptide and White Tea Extract. I paid $19, I think, for this in a sale at one point, so I, I'm thrilled. This is awesome. This retails for a lot, 80 something dollars, I think. And it took, it lasted me a long time. I love Grown Alchemist. I'm not as diehard a Grown Alchemist fan as a lot of people seem to be. People, a lot of people seem to say, I love anything Grown Alchemist. I haven't loved all of their products. I did really like this one. Had I known I was getting that, I might not have gotten the Namaste, but this was the last call and people were saying it was awesome. The next thing, Curly Wipes. Dentist approved, a quick mouth cleanup when no toothbrush is in sight. Okay, 12 single packets. I just can't imagine this being a good replacement for a good toothbrush. Anyway, okay, it's uh, teeth wipes. Okay, it's teeth wipes. That's interesting. I will probably never use these. And I'm really thrilled with this. If I like one more thing, this makes up, this is worth it. So this is Cuccio, oh, this is Yoga Essentials. I used to be really into yoga. There was a time, and I was pretty good. I should get back into it. This is a three pack of Yoga Essentials. So that's why I started talking about yoga. It has this balancing oil, and it's to invigorate. Apply one to two drops per use. Great to keep with you for an afternoon pick-me-up. Wake up the senses or create an experience for yoga and or massage. I don't smell much at all. It's very, very subtle, the scent. Uh, balancing lotion. I'm very picky about my lotions. So this is great for massage, personal use, or yoga classes. I never needed to use lotion in yoga classes. It's very water-based, which I don't tend to lean toward with lotions. Maybe I'll put that in a giveaway. And then this is a yoga mat spray. Whew. Smells like mouthwash to me. Maybe it's just supposed to smell minty and if you smell it directly it can get overwhelming. Maybe I'll use this. This this is the highlight of this. And then this is a brush cleaner. I never use brushes. Or I have been thinking about getting more into makeup, at least for the sake of videos, so that I can try these things out because I watch these videos. I watch people trying out foundations and I don't wear foundations. I don't know why I watch it, but I've learned enough and so maybe I can get me a brush set and I can start playing with some makeup. But I will leave the prices I paid for everything in the description box below and I hope you enjoyed the video. If you haven't subscribed, consider doing so, and I hope you have a wonderful day.